Welcome back to Booze on the Rocks, and I'm your host, David Edwards. Today, we are going to use these to make the classic daiquiri, but first, this. Now let's get to the history of the daiquiri. This drink was supposedly invented by an American mining engineer named Jennings Cox and a Cuban engineer named Pagliucci. They were both in Cuba at the time of the Spanish-American War. The daiquiri made its way to the United States by Rear Admiral Lewis W. Johnson, who introduced it to the Army and Navy Club in Washington. During World War II, rationing made whiskey and vodka very hard to come by, yet because of Franklin D. Roosevelt's good neighbor policy, this made rum much more easily attainable. And then it spread. This drink was one of the favorites of Ernest Hemingway and John F. Kennedy. Now, New Orleans does have a huge daiquiri culture, especially frozen daiquiris, i.e. slushies alcoholic slushies. All right, so let's get into it. So I've got my mixing glass in here and we're gonna need two ounces or 60 mils of uh, Bacardi white rum or white rum. We need half an ounce of freshly squeezed lime juice. Whoops. The knife, of course, which I forgot to put on my table. Now, in an earlier video, I once I said that one lime will give you about a half an ounce. That's incorrect. One lime will give you about one ounce, so half a lime would get you about half an ounce of juice. I need half an ounce of our simple syrup here. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to shake all of this with ice. But first I need some ice. Okay, so one of the things that you'll notice when you're looking at this is you actually see the frost begin up, the, up on the glass. That's why this system of shaking works very, very well. As it gets colder, it contracts. So you'll, have, you'll see that people will have this tendency to, to break the seal that way because it's just the way that works out. We're gonna use a martini glass because it's what I have. And for our garnish, we're going to use a little bit of a lime wheel. And to make it sit on your glass, just give it a slight, a slight cut along one of the lines, about halfway in. And here you have the classic daiquiri. Here, let me just hold this here. It'll look good that way. All right, let's see what it's like. I can definitely smell the lime. This is uh, it's a nice color. You can see the lime, you can smell it. You can get uh, just a hint of the, the rum. That's really good. I really like that. But I'm a barbarian, so. That is really good. You get the rum notes, you get the lime notes. Really, really good, so you get a lot of that that fruit and citrus and you know what you don't get very much of the book the rum at all this is a great summertime drink any warm weather drink you could have this sitting by the pool just sitting out on the back deck at the trailer whatever whatever you plan to do with your day just on a hot day absolutely this drink is definitely on my a list of drinks 
I'm going to put the uh, recipe down below in the description. And if you like this video, hit the uh, subscribe and the thumbs up button. And if you want these notifications, hit the bell button. But if you don't like this video or, or didn't find it useful, hit the thumbs down button twice. And we'll see you next time on Booze on a Rock.